here to show you the lives of a very small community of people. It's called Scotland Island. It's just off the mainland of the Northern Beaches. We've heard some very strange and interesting things about these people. Uh, luckily, we've made contact with one of the locals. His name's Shane, and he's going to be taking us across to the island. He's got his boat just up here. Let's go. Is this him now? Good day, Shane. Oh. Have a good one on the island. Right. Cool. Don't get hit of that as well. Okay, yep. Listen, I'm going to show you a bit of a delicious time on the island. You ready to get going? A what? Sorry, delightful time. Right. Come on, okay. let's get on board. Let's go. We were a bit reserved while heading towards Scotland Island. I will admit that the slap in the face didn't exactly help settle my nerves. We've done our research, and it turns out there's more information on the Amazon tribes than there is on Scotland Island. I read up what I could. The islanders have no toes, and they speak to trees for guidance. There were so many things that we wanted to find out. We needed to know the truth. Does that mean that you guys did come from the mainland? Well, that's a question. Of course it is. Some people think that we came from the mainland, and some people think we came from the sea. Maybe you guys came on the uh, buggies. I didn't expect to see so many golf buggies around. I didn't even know you had a mode of transport here. Well, did you think that we traveled around the island by swimming by the vines and the trees? Yeah, maybe something like that. Well, I'd like to see you give it a shot. We're not all barbarians here. Jeez, I didn't mean to offend you. It's just, you know, no one's actually left this island and lived to tell the tale. It's a big mystery. Come on inside. So this is where I live. Ah, uh, yes, the humble boat. This is the living room, where we gather and tell stories at night time. Um, the kitchen. Nice. Where we prepare a piece. Oh, yes. And in here, I'll show you where you're both going to sleep. So this is where you two will be sleeping. Right, okay. Oh. Yeah, look, I don't mean to be rude, but there's one bed and no sheets. Look, it's summertime here and the nights are really warm. And uh, it's the only room I've got with a nice uh, twin bed in it for both of you. Right. Um, I thought you two were together anyway. No, no, not no. We're not together. You certainly look like you're together. No. Look, it's the only room I've got, so I'm gonna let you two sort it out. Yeah, that's fine. And I'll come back a bit later. Yeah. Thanks a lot. Cheers. This place, though, it's weird. Shane guy, out of touch. Feeling, it's wrong. We'll see how it goes. Then. Shane. Hey, some of the islanders are going down for a bathe. Mm -hmm. This could be something you two yeah. want to experience. Yeah, where are your clothes? We don't wear clothes when we bathe. Right. We go naked. Okay. So, listen, you might want to strip down and come down and join us. Yeah. I'll give we'll you a few that. minutes. Yep, yeah, sure. Okay. Cheers. You know, this might not be all that bad because apparently they don't have toes, and if we can get a peek at whether or not they have toes or not, myth busted, myth confirmed. Should we get changed? Let's, let's get changed. All right, so we're at Tennis Wharf now. Hopefully we can get a shot of their feet. Hey Shane, how are you? Hey, why aren't you jumping in? How come you guys are all wearing shoes? Protect our feet. Protect your feet from what? Getting seen? What got over this with you? Protect our feet from what's underneath the water. Well, I'm sure now that you're getting on land, you'll be able to take those shoes off. <sighs> Rubbish again. You really are treading on thin ice. Yeah, certainly not your toes. Sing it, you two, What the hell? <coughs> Hey, 
door. I've had it for you too. Seriously, get out of it. Get out of it. I've had it. Finn and I just got back from a two hour walk up from the wharf. You know, it was long, it was tiring. Shane left us behind because he was off with something I said. All the lights in the house look like they're off. I think we should just head to bed and get some rest. I know they prepared any dinner for us. We'll just have to eat one of our muesli bars, bro. But yeah, we'll talk to Shane in the morning and we'll sort this out. Let's go. Last night. Actually, not so great. I had to go take a dump in the bushes because you didn't ask where the toilet was. You didn't go near the house, did you? It was actually pretty close. Oh, you're kidding me. Sorry, you're gonna attract a lot of bears. I didn't know you had them. So I completely forgot to tell you guys. That's right. Hey, listen. How about we finish up here and I'll take you down and show you where the toilet is? That's a good idea. Okay, let's go. Let's go. I'm busting anyway. Oh, this is the toilet on the island. Shared by everybody. This is it. This is it. I know it takes one man to change a light bulb. It takes a whole island of people just to make one toilet. Right. You just need to line up there. Yeah, I'll, I'll do that then. All right, I'll leave you to it. Okay, guys. I'll see you later. See you, Shane. see you back at the house. Damn it, he washed his hands. Oi. You know what? We forgot toilet paper. Oh my god, you idiot. I will have to run back up and get some. Um, excuse me, would you uh, mind minding my spot, please? Yeah, that's all right. Thanks, bro. Let's go. All right, we got our toilet paper. Thanks for minding my spot, bro. Who are you, mate? Are you serious? Yeah, I haven't seen you before. You were minding my spot. I don't know you, mate. I know you're a mainlander, so you might as well get to the back of the line. This is ridiculous. I'm sick of this. Finn! You, man, get out of here. You don't need this for your project. What? It's, it speaks to lack of toilet systems on the island. Speak for this. My son is going to join us. Oh, good. Good. Hey, little guy. So nice to finally meet you. How are you? Don't worry about him. He's just hungry. Yeah. I Eat up there, son. Does he? Uh, does he go to school? Uh, no, Islanders don't go to school. All right. They, um, get all their education from the trees. From the trees. I'll show you tomorrow when we go out. Okay. Looks like you get half your food from the trees as well. A bunch of uh, leaves, sticks, and some nasty looking berries. This is a delicacy. Oh, Makes yes. you strong, big. It's one of our special dishes on the island. And toilets. What did you say? I Nothing. I'd just, you know, I'd kill for some meat right now. Meat? Yeah. Something. We only come by now and again on the island. Oh, really? When we go hunting tomorrow, if you're lucky, I might be able to show you. That'd be good. Yeah. Come on, son. Let's leave these two to it. Good night. We'll see you both in the morning. Good night, Shane. Good night. Stop here. Me and my boy, we're just going down here and scout the area. You guys wait here, okay? Alright. Let's go, boy. Guys. We'll see you soon. Yeah. How long will you be? Uh, hopefully, not too long, maybe just a few minutes. Okay. Let's go, boy. We should go find him. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. Yeah, I don't know. It just it just feels so off here, man. I'm not getting that light, so. Mm. Okay. Well look, um, if something happens, just come straight back here, yeah? 
Yeah, of okay. Yeah. Stick tight. Stick tight. Can you see that? Oscar, you're right, buddy. 